mission here is to serve all those who have served. We are grateful for your service to our country and are honored to host this special event today with your family and friends. Again, thank you for your service and for helping us keep the memory alive of what you and other Americans did during one of France's darkest hours. Congratulations.
It's a weekly gathering of veterans who uh, exchange stories. Um, and most important of all, you transmit this memory, and that's so important that you all be able to transmit the experiences you have in your younger generation, so that the memory goes on. Good morning. Mr. Crew, General Wall, Colonel Johnson, thank you for inviting me to be a part of this inspiring ceremony honoring these 11 heroes. To the 11 brave men that we honor today, I say thank you. I have the privilege and honor of commanding the 61st Air Base Group, which came into existence in World War II as the 61st Troop Carrier Group. Later, it was renamed the 61st Transportation Group. And after transferring, after fighting its way in North Africa and Italy, and transferring to the Ninth Air Force, the 61st flew an airborne assault mission during operations Overlord, Market Garden, and Varsity. You all fought on the ground and in the air during these campaigns. The men and women of the 61st Air Base Group are the direct beneficiaries of your valor. Today, we, along with all the men and women of the Armed Forces, stand on the shoulders of your legacy. You laid the foundation which enabled us to grow into the most capable military the world has ever known. We draw inspiration and strength from your example. We remember your sacrifice in retelling the stories of the battles you fought. Mr. Perot, we value the government of the French Republic's willingness to honor these men with this prestigious medal. This action serves as a powerful reminder of the strong alliance between our countries. From the earliest revolutionary days, through two great world wars, and our joint struggle against extremism today, we have shared the common bond of the mind. Your willingness to bestow this honor upon men who are not citizens of your country exemplifies your honor and generosity. So again, I say, Thank you for honoring these members of what we sometimes refer to as the greatest generation. For all of us today, by taking time to honor these men with our presence, we make a small down payment on the debt we owe them and all the members of their generation. Each day we wake up and breathe the air of free democratic nations, we should remember these men and their comrades in arms who helped save the world from tyranny. So again, to the 11 heroes, thank you for what you did on and above the beaches, the hedgerows, the fields, and the valleys of France those many years ago. Thank you. for those very touching remarks. It's, it's now my pleasure to call up uh, Mr. Vicki Simmons, Field Deputy for Supervisor Kanabi, to make a special presentation to our It's my pleasure to present each and every one of you heroes this certificate of recognition. Thank you. 
good picture uh, afterwards. So we, we need to move on. Just present them and we'll move on. Same high school.